This is Cool Japan, and in this video, we're going to do a battle against Dronzer against the four starter bays. You can tell that these are the original starter bays because they have the clear bottoms. The recolors all have colored um, bottoms. Anyway, we're going to follow the, the official rules. So if it's a spin finish, they get one point. If it's an over finish, they get two points. If it's a burst finish, they get two points. And if it's an extreme zone finish, meaning if the bays come out from this pocket, that is three points. Whoever gets four points wins, and we're going to see how this turns out. Let's go.
So as you could see, uh, Dronzo didn't do so bad. It did beat two of the bays. It did beat um, Dransword and I think it was Zidero. Beat. Did pretty good. So um, I guess this could be a perfectly fine Beyblade. Being a plastic gen remake is pretty cool. But um, the one downside about Dronzer is that he is painted. So this part, which I thought was plastic, is actually painted metal. So that makes it scratch off a lot. And it does leave pretty heavy blue marks all around the stadium. It does kind of mess up your stadium if you want to keep up your speed, and it also does put blue marks on the big blades themselves. For example, you can see one on Dran Sword right there. But it was really fun. So far, none of my bays are breaking. I don't see too much damage. Like, there's some dents and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for some more battles.